Hey guys, I'm Richard Dalton. I'm, I am the creator of Profit Renegade and today I am going to show you a quick tutorial on how to set up your proxies. So the first thing you do is you click on settings, you click on options, you click on the proxy tab on the left hand side as you can see that changes. Then you pick which set of threads that you want to mess with front end or back end. In this case we're going to do both. You click in this white area right here, left click one time, you see this little bar and you know you did it correct. And then you right click and you click load, uh, load front end proxy list and then you load in your proxies. And then you click if you want to do the back end you click the back end threads, you right click and you load the back end. Now these threadings are separated so you will see the front end and the back end and they're completely independent of each other so if you don't have a list in the back end but you do on the front end that works if you do on the back end but you don't on the front end that also works so you can mix and match it so that's best for your service um, the user oh well, I should mention you could use a um, open proxies or you can use dedicated proxies with a IP lock in other words you tell them what the IP address is on your service. You usually find it in the proxy C panel. You put it in there, you put in the IP address of your machine, and then you just put the proxies in exactly like this. And then it will work. If you try to do the IP um, port and uh, user pass, that will not work. It has never worked that way. It's not going to work that way. This is only for IP authentication proxies or open proxies. You do not need to click apply unless you want this same list to load next time you open Profit Renegade. If you click apply, that's what will happen. If you do not click apply, it will just open up and it will be empty. User agent strings, that's the same as uh, your browser ID. So basically the more those you have in there, it looks like more people are typing in the information and asking for it. There's already 500 in there. Uh, there's an unlimited amount. You can put as many as you want, but you really don't need to. Those work fine. And of course, you have the safe settings, the apply button, and the back out of your console button. And that is it for the settings, options, and proxy setup for today. If you have any questions or problems, you let me know. If you have any questions, just put your mouse over the area and look up here and you'll get a quick tutorial. Alright guys, you have a great day. Bye.